You may think you are familiar with Volkswagen's worldwide range, but there is always the chance you are missing out on a few models. This is probably the case with the Volkswagen Lamando, a Chinese-built sedan that is now getting a full revamp as a liftback for its second generation as a series of photos released on Chinese media suggest. The Lamando was first unveiled in 2014 as a sleeker version of the Jetta produced by the Volkswagen, Seic Venture for the Chinese market. The second generation distances itself from the more conservative styling of its predecessor, while adopting design cues from the ID family. The large intake on the front bumper in combination with the aggressive headlights divided by a thin chrome strip creates an evil smile on Lamando's face. At the same time, the clamshell bonnet and the heavily inclined roofline towards the back bring Volkswagen Ardian vibes. Moving over at the back, the dark tinted and connected taillights can be found in the ID4 fully electric SUV, however in sedan form they look similar to the Peugeot 508, although less dramatic. Following the trend, the Lamando doesn't have visible tailpipes, but decorative ones featuring a chrome or glossy black finish. The first-generation Volkswagen Lamando is based on the MQB platform, and we expect the new generation to move on to the evolved MQB Evo architecture. This is the same platform underpinning the popular Golf 8 hatchback among several other models of the Volkswagen Group. Under the bonnet, there will be the good old 1.4-psi engine producing 148 horsepower mated to a 7-speed DSG gearbox sending power to the front wheels. As is the case with the outgoing generation, the new Volkswagen Lamando won't be exported to European or North American markets, where sedans and liftbacks are not popular anymore. The new model will be available in China and a few export markets like the Philippines after its official unveiling which will take place before the end of 2021.